it was a it was a great surprise match when it happened, and it was a pleasure to watch back at it. And I think this was the last time that we saw the demon. I feel like this is the last time we saw the demon uh, back then. Um, uh, no, I know. I think you might be right. No, no, he was he was at WrestleMania. Was he? Uh, yeah, yeah, I was there. Who? Mania in New York. Who did he work at Mania? Uh, Samoa. Uh, no, no. Um, I know it was someone. Uh, uh, I know it was someone. I would hope. Um, hold on, hold on. Googling and also thinking. Checking out the WrestleMania brain. Um, that wasn't the three way uh, with Seth and Lashley. Lashley. Oh yeah, that's right. Lashley. Mm. Was, was he Lashley. demon then? Like yeah, it was Lashley. Yeah, it was Lashley for the IC title because he actually beat Lashley yeah. with like um, power moves and shit. Oh, oh yeah, okay. he is. Yeah, yeah. The demon entrance was very lackluster. That's probably yeah. why you don't remember it. And, uh, and for also, being for being WrestleMania, yeah, they could have gone all out and did not. Yeah, yeah. that's unfortunate. Because the set at Mania that year was just a giant LED board. Yeah, I'm looking at a uh, fan cam actually right now of it. That's the first thing that came up for me. So um, that's unfortunate. Well, it was the last memorable. You're right. <laughs> the demon. Uh, but this was a dream match, a match that I know they said on commentary at least. Uh, that this did not happen, I believe, in Japan. Well, I think they were on the same team at Bullet Club in Japan, so I guess they wouldn't have faced each other for the most part. Well, they weren't there at the same time. Oh, oh, AJ came in when Finn left, right? Yeah. Like, he yeah. was kind of the replacement. It was literally the rotating door of Finn out, <coughs> AJ in. Mm-hmm. So, so they never even stood on the same side. So I think the, the allure of this literally being a first-time thing mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. helped with it. And I don't remember why Bray had to get off, uh, had to remove himself from the show. Like, it wasn't it a um, they were going to do Demon versus Sister Abigail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, it was, was it Demon or was it Pumpkin King? It was Pumpkin King versus it's, Demon. Well, Demon Pumpkin. It was the yeah. Great Pumpkin. Girl, it was man. the Great That's Pumpkin. Finn Balor. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, wasn't that the wasn't that the pay per view where everyone had like. Liver enzyme issues or something. Yeah, like that. I do think it's the liver enzyme uh, yeah, scheduled. What? Yeah, he was he was removed from the match card due to a viral infection, according right. to Wikipedia. There were, there were, I think Reigns got it. I think JoJo got it. Mm-hmm. Bray mm-hmm. got it. Yeah, there were a handful of people. Yeah, um, because uh, they threw in Kurt Angle to that main event. That's right. With the he was, <laughs> yeah, uh, and he was the most <laughs> awkward member. <laughs> of the field. Yep, yep. He was uh, a Kurt Angle Shield member it was, for one it was night. It's like a dad wearing his hat sideways. Just <laughs> so it's like, awkward. hey, how do you do, fellow Shield members? Hey guys, I am also in the Shield. <laughs> it was an odd night, but that was definitely probably the highlight out of that. Um, so, what did you guys think of the match? I, I, I it was, it was, uh, it, it was fantastic. It's tremendous. Yeah. It was tremendous. Yeah, it was great. I um, mean. Yeah, yeah, there's not there's not a whole lot to say, but like if it's it's AJ Styles and Finn Balor, like mm-hmm. you're gonna get a good match out of it. Even it, like what's more interesting to me is how they got AJ there. Mm-hmm. Like I forget which documentary it was. I want to say maybe AJ three sixty five mm. or something like that. I think but was. they did a whole documentary where they like he told he told the cameras what it took to get him there. Where did like, he, cause I think I think he got there like at bell time for the show. Where did he fly from? Were they in South Africa? I feel or like it was Japan, Japan, something like that. Yeah, yeah. Like he flew all night straight there, and then yeah, yeah. Like it's it's such a like match aside. More people need to praise him for that sort of work ethic, mm-hmm. like just being gung ho to fly straight from another country, probably not sleeping at all, if barely, and coming in there putting on that quality of a match. Mm-hmm. Like, JJ's such a workhorse, especially at that age. Um, Yeah, no, I mean, I don't have a ton to say about the match either. It's great. Yeah, yeah. Um, there were a lot of cool moments in it. Like, there was, there was the moment where AJ cut, <clears throat> cuts him off, Finn goes for the dive, and AJ slides in, and it – it's not a close. It was almost just like a body block, mm-hmm. like so, so, like it knocked my breath out. Like <laughs> I lost my wind looking at it because it was just like, pow, so solid. Um, I, I'm always amazed when, um, because uh, Finn does the it was the coup de gras 
at the time, yes. the, the double stomp. Yeah. And uh, you, you could tell when, like, you know, I don't, I don't know what it's trust or whatever it is, but when it he he delivers that and it just like he lands right straight on your gut in that thing, yeah. and it was straight on for this. And I, you know, I and I know something happened with that too, but like it looks so absolutely brutal sometimes. Like it wasn't anything where he landed, then he falls on his back. Like yeah, it's or just you, like nope, or or the feet like s- kind of slide off to the side, so you don't really get an impact. It was just like it's like he stuck the landing mm-hmm. and just let it sit there. Yep, here I am, right on your liver. Uh, <laughs> Because it was like the stomach, but off to the side too. Which is like, ooh, um, that's the soft part. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it always, it always like. I wonder how many times Finn has hit that move, and the person that he has hit the move on like regrets the dinner they had right before the match, yeah, and just yeah. like, just like shits their pants. <laughs> Uh, that's, that's I'm sure it's happened. I guarantee it's happened. That's like that's one of those moves where your your fate is completely in their hands and they could totally if they like you take care of you and not they could just murder you. Mm-hmm. Like mm-hmm. Yoko and his bonsai. Mm-hmm. Like if Yoko liked you, cool. If not oh. Or when Jeff Hardy <laughs> came back and he was not mm. giving a crap about that swan yeah. top. <laughs> like, I'm just gonna lay on you. Remember, like, listen, man, this is gonna suck. Because Here's my body. Or, or, or like, uh, like I've also heard that there's something like that with Jeff Hardy now too. Mm. When, when he does the swanton, mm. like if Jeff, like, oh, yeah, that's what doesn't, we're talking. doesn't get enough rotation on it. They call it the crouton. Yeah. Cause it's just like everything <laughs> landing back on chest. That's right. It gets <laughs> gross sometimes. It's just like, that's, you can tell. You can tell. <laughs> oh, geez. Um, no, yeah, it was a, it was a, uh, and once again, just looking around it, um, it was interesting to see. One, this was a Raw era pay-per-view, like a Raw exclusive when we did that for a while. When they were still trying to convince us they were going to stick to it. Yeah, yeah. Once yeah. again, by the way. Yeah. Uh, so it was a big deal because I think AJ was a SmackDown guy. And also, mm-hmm. also Kurt, while he was in that match, was also at the time the general manager of the same uh, side of things. Yeah. So uh, it, it, it was just wild to see that back then. Booker T on the commentary. Miss you, Booker. Oh, mm, do we? Do we? I do. Do we? I know? do. Quacky. Uh, I don't. Qu- quacky. Quacky. What do you say? Quacky. Shucky, Shucky ducky, ducky. Quack. 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 You, quack. Shucky, you, ducky. Quack. Quack. You quack. don't miss him that much if he can't get the gimmick right. So, I listen, man. I, I need more coffee. Come on. It's been a long show. <laughs> we we have breaking news. We have we had a hiccup scare. We. Had oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Glad to see you're doing better. Yeah, Glad to see you're doing better. better. Now. I've recovered. Um, um, we had jokes. We had jo- well, that's still questionable. Well, that's that's, that's uh, debatable. Questionable. <laughs> um, my biggest thing about that match going into it, I knew AJ wasn't going to lose because mm-hmm. at that point you pretty much knew the demon was was indestructible and yeah, you know. So I was I went and going. This is going to be a good match, but I know how it's going to end. Mm-hmm. So that which was- is weird because the demon had lost. Like the demon lost to Joe on Finn's way out of NXT. Yeah, but that's mm. NXT. Yeah, yeah, it's an undefeated in WWE thing, and NXT don't count. Yeah, kind of situation. That's one so. of it's one of those things. Yep, yep, <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> so, uh, I do miss the fan interaction of his uh, intros. I thought it was one of the greatest things at the time. Mm-hmm. Uh, See, so, I mean, it was always. Um, just like seeing an entire crowd do the yes thing in mo- in in motion, right? Like being there, watching a whole crowd throw their hands up for that that uh, music, mm-hmm. um, is just was always like one of the really cool moments for those. So yeah, it's just it's one of those things that I I don't think we're gonna get again anytime soon, and it's just a it's a nice thing to think about. Mm-hmm. 